And our story on Restoration Day has generated several phone calls and emails about the interpretation of King Kamehameha III's speech. KITV 4's Brenton Awa is here to explain. Brenton? Kenny, there are several interpretations of the phrase. The city says that one of those is the life of the land is restored in righteousness, but a lot of callers didn't agree. Translated. The life of the land is perpetuated in righteousness. The life of the land is perpetuated in its righteousness. The life of the land is perpetuated in its righteousness. The life of the land is perpetuated in righteousness. Everyone we spoke with on the street knew that phrase with the keyword perpetuated. Hawaiian words have lots of meanings, but the context frames how you understand the word. Puakea Nogomeyer is a professor of Hawaiian language at UH Manoa. He's also a Hawaiian songwriter. And the voice on the bus that pronounces all those Hawaiian street names, that's him too. Nogomeyer says while the city's event dealt with the restoration, the phrase does not. Never restored. Restored is something, I mean, that's, there's other words that would fill that slot. I'm not sure where that interpretation came from. Nogelmeyer says that in 1843, King Kamehameha III gave a speech to celebrate the return of sovereignty to the Hawaiian kingdom. Wamo in that phrase, Wamo Kea, um, means either is permanent, is perpetual, is salvaged, is solid. The Mary Kavena Pukui Hawaiian Dictionary says the life of the land is preserved in righteousness. Nogelmeyer says there are many interpretations. Today we interpret it as like the well-being of Hawaii is kept alive or kept going through our good behavior. Nogelmeyer says the original interpretation was the sovereignty of the land is ongoing because of righteousness. The standard interpretation is the life of the land is perpetuated in righteousness. Now, Sometimes that doesn't make enough sense to people even in English. And the city says its fact finder got the original phrase from the Hawaiian newspaper at the time. It says the original phrase was e mo kea o kaini kapono. And one of the original translations was the land is restored. It says the phrase was later changed when it became the state motto. Kenny, back to you.